Got a minute? I'm Pete Skirbunch, Defense Commissary Agency historian with a minute of history. In 1877, former slave Henry Flipper became the first African-American graduate of the U.S. Military Academy. As a second lieutenant, he soon became quartermaster and assistant commissary of subsistence at Fort Davis, Texas, ordering food for mess halls, issuing rations, and selling commissary goods to soldiers at the post. Court-martialed for stealing commissary funds, he was found innocent of theft, but convicted of conduct unbecoming an officer and was dishonorably discharged. Undaunted, he became a businessman, newspaper editor, special agent for the Justice Department, translator for a Senate subcommittee, and assistant secretary of the interior. In 1976, the Army determined racism had inspired and driven the court-martial and changed his discharge to honorable. In 1999, President Clinton cleared Flipper's name by overturning President Chester Allen Arthur's endorsement of the original verdict. With a minute of history, I'm Pete Skirbunk, DECA historian.